Now, a family of the four men who were shot dead in Nairobi's Buruburu estate have positively identified their kin. The family that remained tight-lipped over the incident is now seeking justice, saying that their son was an innocent man, earning a decent living from selling second-hand clothes. This even as police investigate the matter, with clues pointing to what police say could be an inter-gang altercation. Hassan Mugambi reports. At the city mortuary Nairobi, officials here say that one family has positively identified their kin among the four that were executed when their vehicle came under a hail of bullets in Buruburu area of Nairobi. The family that we found at the city mortuary, however, declined to grant us an interview on camera, saying that they are yet to process the unfolding events right before their eyes. They, however, confirm that they have identified their son, adding that he was just a mutumba seller dealing with second-hand clothes. Even as the family struggles to come to terms with the shocking incident that saw this car shot at least 40 times and all the four occupants killed, detectives handling the matter are pursuing leads of a possible gang rivalry. Police say a hunt is on for the perpetrators believed to be two shooters using assault rifles who are said to have trailed this vehicle before cornering them in Buruburu area. An autopsy on the bodies of the four is expected on the 27th of December, even as police seek to profile the victims to establish a possible motive behind the point-blank execution. Hassan Mugambi, Citizen TV.